everyone, today I am back with a small haul of Goodwill items. Let's start off with these leggings that are this cool animal print and the inside is like thermal lined so they're so soft and cozy. And I live in leggings in the winter so I know I'm going to get a lot of use out of these. These were in the pajama section, although I don't believe these really were pajamas. So they were only I believe $2. This top actually goes with the uh, leggings very well, too, and this was on sale. It was black tag, so it was only $1, and it is this faux suede with a fringe on the bottom, and it's just plain beige, so I think this will go with a lot of different things. I found this blue sweater by Worthington. This was around $4, and I love the pearl detail, the pastel blue. This is just the perfect sweater for spring, especially since pastels are so big this year. That was, yeah, around $4. And a lilac or purple or whatever you want to call it, uh, beret. How lucky was it to find that? And this is by Liz Claiborne. This was, I believe, around like a dollar is all this was. And um, this is something I know I'm going to be wearing this spring, too. Luckily, we still have some cool days, so it actually worked out very well. And last but not least, this brand new little floral wallet, which is also so perfect for spring. I was kind of debating whether I actually liked this floral print or not, but um, it's growing on me even more after I bought it. But I love especially the size of these wallets because... They're very small, and I'm trying not to carry a lot. I try, I'm trying not to carry a lot around with me anymore these days. Anyway, it has the little change pocket on the back, and as I said, the best part it's, it hasn't even been used. And this was, I believe, a dollar or two because um, I also got a book um, and maybe something else, but everything was only twelve dollars. So I definitely got a lot of good deals. So let me know in the comments below what is your favorite item out of this haul. Thank you so much for watching.